everybody. Got a couple people here. Um, welcome to a random live stream. This is going to be the new reserve. First look at Veldebu, Veldeboy. I don't know how it's pronounced. It's Valley of the Wood. <laughs> and you know that much. Uh, we're going to be doing uh, the new map. So here we go. This will be a one hour first look. This first part will be a one hour with Aiden and I. We're going to do a first look vid. And then we're going to jump into... I'm going to jump off for an hour, get some dinner, uh, get this video onto YouTube so that I uh, can get the word out about the live stream and hopefully get some more people in here. Hey, Ninja. Uh, Derby Kid, what's going on? And then we'll be, we'll be doing... Um, what will we be doing? Then I'll be back at 6 p.m. An hour after I get off of here. Uh, so this will be about an hour, then I'll be off for an hour, and then I get back at 6 p.m. on here, and we're going to have a, uh, about an eight-hour marathon from 6 p.m. till 2 a.m. my time. Just be, just be friggin' hunting all night. So that's what we're doing. This first part will be just Aiden and I, and then he's got to jump off. We're going to get dinner, and he's got to go with Mama. So here we go. We're already in the map, and Aiden's already walking around. I already got it set up, so... Uh, let's go ahead and make sure our video is up here. It looks good. Aiden, how you doing? Come here. Aiden. Hey, you hear me, bud? Yeah. Okay. Stop right there. So, we're going to be wearing... Uh, this is a summary map. This is a new reserve. just came out this morning. Uh, I came in here for about 5-10 minutes. Just walked around like no more than 50 meters from the lodge here. And uh, just kind of stared up at the mountains. So this will be pretty much the first look. Aiden made it a little farther than I did. He went about 100 meters. And then uh, we jumped out of there. So uh, we're both wearing our sneaky uh, sneaky summery forest uh, doodads here. Oh, look at this. Get, get a nice little... There we go. Huh? Father and son? <laughs> yeah. Aiden just finally... I just had to get him that outfit. I've been meaning to get him the summery one for a long time, but... Uh, finally did. So that's a good camo to have in here. The Boone and Crockett would work well if you're hunting roe deer and red stag in here. I don't know how it works for the new Alpine Ibex. Hey, what's going on, everybody? So, basically, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's it. That is what we got going on here with our, our, uh, outfits. And then I'm going to be taking the 7mm, and I did bring my favorite scope, However, I'm probably going to switch. I'm going to put that in the backpack because I want to take it with. We're going to put the 12 by 50 in there because this is a long range map. Evil's been in there for the last couple hours, several hours. And uh, he said, just to FYI, you're going to want to bring something long range. Uh, so we're going to take our, our big old scope there and we'll put the other one in the backpack. Then we've got our bow, which I prefer to use. We'll be using that lots tonight. Uh, we'll take the Parker Python with the little sight for that. And I'm going to take my brand new 44 that I just bought and uh, take that out for a little rip around here. I'll probably take the 454 later, though, uh, just because I kind of like to use that one, too. So we do have our climbing gear. This is something that is new that came out today. I, you know what? I haven't even read all this. Um, I've really, I didn't know all this was here because a lot of questions, but I'm going to need to go through and read all this here later. Uh, but we'll get into that here in just another second, how this works from what we know. There's still a lot that we don't know, but Evil was in trying to, trying to figure it out. Um, and then we're also, I bought a med, a first aid kit. Uh, Evil was in there and fell once already. He was trying to get a, he was trying to get, a, a harvest a kill that he had on the ground and he slipped and fell about only five feet. He slid five feet and he died. And so luckily he had a med kit, so... I guess it's going to be pretty crucial now to carry med kits if you're in this map because there's a lot of falling and dying going on, especially if you're rock climbing. So we probably, unfortunately, will not get to do the rock climb during this hunt. I don't know. Uh, only because Aiden doesn't have any rock climbing gear. He is the one that's hosting so that I can get better bandwidth. And I don't know if it's going to let me put the my gear down in his map. Uh it won't let you it won't let me place tree stands tents none of that stuff that's always been that way 
So I'm guessing it's probably not going to let me use my rock climbing gear in his, but uh, no worries because after we get back up and going at 6 p.m. with the big stream, I'm going to start out hosting. I've got all kinds of brand new tents, a brand new bear bait barrel, a tower stand, um, tents, I think I said that, I've got lots of stuff to put out and Evil and I are going to go out and set up a nice area. Uh, as far as Aiden, he's carrying the... Aiden, go into your eye. I can't remember. Okay, yeah, he's carrying his 300, he's got his 12 gauge. Uh, got him the, t the scope for the, the red dot scope for the 12 gauge. He's got his um, snake bite bow in his backpack so that we could probably switch that out. But the reason I got him the pump 12 gauge is he's carrying buckshot because I've heard that there are a ton of fox in here. Evil busted, I think, about a dozen of them in his hunt so far. They're just there are a lot of, of uh, fox in here. So I've got the bow. I mean, he's got it too, but we're going to have him carry the shotgun. And then he's got his tent, and once we put his tent down, we're going to dig out the rest of his gear. We've got to go out and try to put his bait barrel down. I don't know if it'll happen, but um, that's kind of what we're looking at. So um, let's get to hunting. Let's get her done. And then, yeah, so he's pretty much just going to be shooting with the 300, and uh, he's like I said, he's we might get his bow out, but I'm, I'm pretty much thinking since this will be a pretty quick first look, uh, just to get something up on the YouTube so that I don't have to go ahead and edit and render and upload which would take me about a day or two uh, we'll get we'll do do a twitch stream and send it over that's the reason why you guys aren't seeing the chat on the uh, on the live stream I've disabled that since I uh, uh, be putting this over on YouTube so what we're gonna do uh, going back to the climbing gear I'll talk about that as we're walking this path that leads out this way, this this first ledge that we see right here, this is the first ledge you have to climb. So you're going to need a full 20 use um, climbing gear. And then to get up this ledge, you're going to need a second one. Okay? So this is a quick, easy shortcut. Now, one way around that is, and this is what Evil had done, he went all the way I don't know why it's going goofy on me here um, he started out at the the South Lodge and he walked all the way up and uh, I think what he did was he came around this side is what he did so cuz he's been in here for lots of hours already doing the same hunt um, he's still in there I believe so uh, that's that's the way of getting around it and that's why using climbing gear to get up this is really a good ibex area here you're gonna find a lot of those alpine ibex here I also can see, I think there's another ledge, maybe two ledges here to climb up. So you cannot climb on top of this mountain here from what I understand. You can't even hunt. You can't go up there. Uh, it's just too high. I think, you know, you kind of are restricted to the green area here. So that's what we're looking at. So for this hunt right now, we're going to kind of do a river bottom. I hear there's a lot of bear. And uh, maybe we'll go check out, see what this, this spot is. Maybe it's a nice overlook. And uh, we'll kind of have a, a general hunt down in this area. And then tonight when I'm hosting the hunt with Evil, we'll go for a climb. I've already got all my gear. Just Aiden doesn't doesn't have any yet. Wasn't able to get time to purchase him any. And I'm kind of apprehensive about that anyway. Yeah, I think if you fall, you destroy the... You, you do big damage on the gear. Because it says that it's... It says it's for two... Uh, it has two fall uses or something like that, which to me means everything, you get 20 uses, but it's safe for up to two falls, is what it said. So I'm guessing if you screw up, uh, when you're walk, when you're going up it, you have to balance yourself with the W, with the A and the D and climb with the W. And if you mess that up... Ooh, a fox. I am a fox. Yep, there is a fox. I'll get my fox call out. Maybe Aiden can bust this one right quick. I don't know which spot. But yeah, if you if you screw up going up, because there's a little bar that goes in your screen, you're going to end up falling down and uh, tearing up your gear. So I'm not quite sure I want to have Aiden jump into that yet. Good job, buddy. Put that away now. Here. Oh, 
probably put it in my inventory. Yeah, put it in your inventory. That's good. Boy, he's getting good with that. I have him put it in his inventory so he doesn't accidentally use it. And he doesn't have any calls or anything uh, for this map, so he's carrying his binoculars. And uh, Aiden, crouch down. Crouch down. There you go. Let's um. Let's try to go up on this rock. Pretty nice to just leave the reserve and have a fox coming. I just hear there's a buku a fox along here. Come up on here and lay down on the rock. There you go. Get your shotgun out. Got it out. You already got it out. I don't know where it is. This scope is really not good. Oh, it's good. You don't need to look around for it yet. I got him the new shotgun scope there to help him too with the hog hunts and stuff. He should have buckshot. I think this might be his first... Fo hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't move. Don't move. Back up. Back up on the rock. You gotta get up on the rock. You get going down the other side and you won't be able to shoot up. Stay still now. Stay still. Stay still. These fox are really uh, good at spotting and smelling you, so it's important to wear the, the, the right camo. It helps to get off the ground on a rock so that you aren't laying in the grass with grass blades in your way and you're prone so you can steady your shot and you're, you're not too visible. It's very, very important when you're calling in fox and coyote. They have incredible sense of smell and sight and, and hearing. And oh, 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 oh. Hit the bow button. My deal out here. Okay, Aiden, look this way. I wasn't paying attention. He's going to be down coming off the river. He'll be running alongside the river. Look that way. Make sure he's able to spin. He was at the end of his turning. That little that little guy's gonna pop right up over this deal here. I definitely will not be doing anything other than the hunting tonight. This is a special live stream only for the new reserve. Not gonna hunt any other reserve, not gonna hunt uh, anywhere else, just the new reserve, no other games, just the hunter tonight. Did farming on uh, a lot last night, a couple hours of it, and then we did farming on Tuesday night as a special live stream, so we've definitely had our had our farming time. Now it's We did all our work on the farm, now it's time to play. And I'm thinking... Yeah, this fox was pretty far away, but I'm kind of wondering if it didn't spook and run off already when I wasn't paying attention. Um, I'm nervous that I can't... I don't... The good thing is, is you don't even have to worry about aiming that great. You just have to put that red dot near that fox and pull the trigger. You got buckshot in there, so... It's just that... By the time he gets up to this hill where we can see him, he's going to be so close, he'll probably spot us. I, I think this fox is... Uh, he, he probably spotted us over here. Look off already, I don't know. Calling. Do more calling. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just trying to listen and look. Um, 
I think it's uh, not to worry. I think this fox may have escaped us, but usually these these things will uh, be very fast. Getting here very, very quickly. They run when they hear that call. Okay, let's go. Hit your space bar up one time now. He doesn't prone too often. And then, let's go. That's that's really surprising. It's it's only maybe, you know, maybe one time out of ten that you're going to hear a fox call it and not see it. Uh, maybe, maybe it's more than that. Maybe it's like one time out of twenty times that that happens, but... Um, who knows, we were goofing around a little bit there trying to get this, that, and the other done, so... Uh, we missed out that opportunity, but, uh... The one, <laughs> the one thing that drives me crazy about this, uh... And maybe it's in the other reserves, but I noticed it in here is the mosquito sound. Oh, it just makes me want to slap at my ear, like I got a damn mosquito in my ear. <laughs> And I haven't been up in the tall of the mountain. Oh, what is this? Is the roe? Did I just hear a roe deer? Oh, a red. I, I just barely heard that. Um, let me get my red deer call out. That's my roe. Six is probably my... Okay. Red deer. You sound silly. Yeah, it does sound silly though, doesn't it? Uh, one thing about this map, in case anybody's wondering, this is an alpine, you know, base. If you couldn't tell, uh, it's kind of based on the French French Alps. Uh, from what? So I guess maybe we got a little bit of France here, the French Alps. But this is definitely European. That's why we have the European critters. Uh, there is the brown bear in here. There's the alpine ibex, which is a new critter that we're, we got up in the mountains. We're not likely to see anything like that down here. I'd be shocked if we did. Uh, we shouldn't see anything like that down here. Um, and... Oh, what else? We got? Oh, we got the uh, roe deer. We got the red fox. I think I covered them all. Red roe, red fox. I'm missing something. Brown bear and ibex. Nope, that's all five. <laughs> oh, and don't forget red deer. I yep, said red. Red deer, red fox. Roe deer. Opine ibex, brown bear. Oh, oh. This is a email, most likely, or something. Email, here, yeah. We'll have Aiden get it, maybe, with the... I don't know if I could... I could get it. We'll get really close to it. He's never, he's never too sure with his shots. Never too... Sh with his uh, shots until he busts something and then oh my god now he's the best hunter ever oh oh Jesus hey, stop oh god stop Aiden get your 300 out get your 300 out well I got a little close to it so it's not that big but shoot it shoot it shoot it shoot it I don't want to move Oh, put it to sleep, son. Good job. Look <laughs> how this rifle is a beast. Yeah. Yes, it is, buddy. Oh. If that would have been a really big one, that thing would have spooked. I can't believe how close we walked up to it. Oops. And you put her to sleep, Aiden. Good job. Should we take? I'm gonna. I'm gonna grab it for you here. Don't. Uh, come over here. I want to get the screenshot for you. Oh, look at that. He got a left lung, liver, stomach, and intestine. Boy, what a great shot. What a great shot. All right. And uh, that's even a nice trophy shot there. If uh, if you want to... Actually, I'm going to push H. I was not the, the shooter here. I'll just put all my stuff away. Aiden, look up. Look up. Look up there. 
Keep looking up a little bit. No, over here. There you go. Whoop. He's like staring almost directly up into the sky, but that's what you gotta do to make it look right. And um, I think that we'll do something nice. Nice little screenshot like that. I, I think that might have been his first uh, red deer, folks. I think that might have been his first one. And uh, that'll be good. Okay. What, what, what I just did, I just aim a bam. And, and, and their gear and was just like looking after the sky. And then I, I, just I know. Bam. And him just saying, uh, him almost was just to run away. But, 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 since the bullet went right through him, then him just lay on the floor. Yeah, and now who's a good hunter? Who's a good hunter now? Other gun I just use. Oh, the Uza gun? You're, you're a good hunter, huh? Yeah. You're right, guy. I keep walking to you. Alright, we gotta try to find something else we can shoot at here. Ah. We'll just let out a few calls and... There is no call for the Alpine Ibex. There is no call for it, so... Uh, and the brown bear, of course, for no call. Ooh, got another red deer. We're just going to clean up on some reds. Uh oh, I'm going to shoot another red deer, okay, Dad? I already see it, I think. But I saw something moving. Not using face paint since this will be such a short hunt, but tonight when we go in, I'll definitely be putting on some uh, some of our good old camo face paint, and uh, you know maximizing our ability. Well, look at this. It's a nice little island right there. It's not too bad. Oh, and I can see it right there, but it's really hard to, um, Aiden, no, 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 put your gun down, put your gun down, every other. We're definitely not going to shoot at it yet. I'd like to find out what it is first. I'm gonna go prone. No, I already am. Okay. I need to hold my weapon as steady as I can. This is a 12 by 50. I'm not gonna shoot quite yet. I wanna spot him out. He's a uh, he's another small one. But I think he'll be walking over here. I'm I'm not. Uh, yeah, I see a spot right there. We can walk across. I guess I'll uh, probably could take him. From here. <laughs> All right, right into the friggin' water. Nice. Nice little little lung heart action right there. Um, but yeah, I, I didn't want to shoot at first because I didn't want to have to have trouble getting across the river. But you can see all these rocks. This is uh, very common in the hunter, as you know, for uh, being able to uh, represent a shallow spot to to walk across. So, hey, monkey dog, what's going on? Sorry, everybody. This uh, this this chat will um, will not you know it's not onto the screen there. This will be for a first look YouTube video, and I'll be uh, definitely acknowledging everybody in the chat a whole lot more later uh, on our on our big live stream, the eight hour marathon that we're gonna do starting at six p.m. And uh, hope everybody's able to come join me in a whole lot more. Will be there'll be a, roughly about an hour break between this live stream and the and the uh, the big one there. So we'll be going for uh, well another about another thirty minutes. In fact, I think uh, now that we've shot, Aiden, let's just stand up. And let's do some walking. We're gonna have to walk and stand up to get across here. And uh, we're gonna try to. 
Try to beat feet a little bit. This is the uh, the world. So beautiful. Holy cow. And these mountains we're going to be hunting in. I'm going to speed up time a little bit. Look at this stream. I mean, this just makes me want to go get a fishing pole. And I'm not even a big fisher. And I, I just want to stand out here with a pair of hip waders and just fish whatever trout or whatever they got over there. I mean, it is mountain water. You just want to drink it. <laughs> it's going to look really beautiful. Right now it's uh, 6.30. Oh, 7.30. Wow. I suppose that mountain's blocking the sun right here. Uh, 7.30 already, and it looks like it's half dark out. But in the middle of the afternoon, I've seen it, and... Kind of raining a little bit. And it's really neat looking. Nice nice lighting, and we'll see that here in a bit. Um, a fleeing red deer? Aiden, I think uh, if, I, if I was smart, I should have marked out where my deer was. Uh-oh. What is that? I thought it was in that pool right there. Maybe it was in this one. Oh, walk right past it. Alright, I was going to say, I thought it was right in here. Um, yeah, it's a really small one. <laughs> but uh, 156, I think his is a 155. But uh, we had a right lung and a liver on that one. And uh, that's my first kill on the... Oh, cannot, cannot put player over there. Aiden and I are inspecting the uh, the kill here. Can't really get a good view on this one. We'll end up, hey, it'd be my first underwater shot. Yeah, yeah that's, that is, actually, I'll just go with that. That is kind of a funny, uh, funny picture. Uh, weird. So, wow. I just do some more running. Want to do more running simulator, huh? No, don't run. Oh my goodness. Look at that rainbow. That just looks so awkward. <laughs> oh, it looks so beautiful. Does it? Yeah. Oh, you see it too now. Sometimes you don't see the rainbow is the same, but he sees it too. Let me see. Look at the rainbow again. Yeah, and it's phase, fading away at the same time. That's neat, because a lot of times he'll see a rainbow, I won't, and vice versa, but... They got her synced back up a lot better now. Stalker Zion! Glad you found the stream too. Oh, and this is, uh... Just to get us warmed up, there are a lot of good games coming out this uh, fall, and things we'll be covering, and... Of course, the, other, the one everybody is asking me about is the uh, farming simulator on October 30th, and I already got my wife to take off a couple days of work around that time, so I'll just be sitting here waiting, and as soon as it's available on Steam, which we'll know before, so we didn't know when this map was coming. I had a feeling it was coming from Tuesday night to, to this morning, and it did. It came out at the end of that time. Uh, but, so it came out on Thursday for, for Swedish, of Swedish time, Sweden, which is where these folks are at. And we got another red deer here, Aiden. I guess this is a red deer hunt on the new map. Yeah, I think I'm going to take it out, I think. Yep, that'll be fine. Maybe it'll be an epic trophy. So we basically... um, just going to do a nice walk along this beautiful stream. I wish the weather would get bright out. Really a beautiful, beautiful uh, map. Let's um, let's just think about this now. It was on the other side of this little island, so maybe if we hmm, I I have a great idea. You have a great idea. Uh, 
Uh, um, put my tree stand up and do like a, uh, I know, we need to. Oh, and that's the thing, the announcement I was going to make is I got Aiden a bait barrel set up for the bear, a couple tree stands, and we're going to find a like a like a bowl that we can put the, the, the bait barrel down in, and I'm hoping to be able to host some big multiplayer hunts. So it's, again, it's going to take one to two weeks for that thing to, to get full... You know, full attractiveness, so it won't be anything we'll be seeing the next few days, but uh, and definitely not today. But I got him a couple tree stands so that we can hunt it close. But I was thinking if we could get like a multiplayer, I could open it up during live streams, and we could have all a bunch of people around this, you know, area, and we could all open fire on a bunch of brown bear, kind of do like a little. And we're also kind of on the lookout for an island. Um, we have this island here. There's an island over here, but these are all low. These are islands, but they're not really islands because, you know, you can, things can escape in several places. A uh, stream, you can pretty much walk through it. So I don't see a place to necessarily, you know, maybe maybe over here, send all the bears, like put a bait barrel in this dip here and line people up here and as you can't the bear I think they can run over here we could put people here to block this they can't run up here or here and they can't go outside the map so I was kind of eyeing this area up because I think it's a good you know put that there put a tent up here kind of a thing maybe another tent down here and people can spawn in and kind of cover cover this area here Somebody could go here and we can start shooting all down in here. That's kind of the one thing I did see. Because a bear can only really go one way. They could, Well, they could go three ways. They could shoot out there, but they got to go this way and that way. And that's why we'll be here to block them. So, those are the things that we're going to be doing in the in the stream here in a little while. Uh, tonight, I've got all my gear ready to put out. Aiden does too, but I don't think we're going to get time in this little first look I wish we could see an ibex Ooh, where did it go? what the hell is it? oh it's a little female I didn't even hit the second shot, but I could see the first shot was right in the kill zone. Sorry, Aiden, I had to take that one. It was just a female. Just um, had to take it because it was running away. I was almost going to let it go. <laughs> I thought, well, eh, let's shoot it. Try to bag a couple kills. Uh, the schedule is in the title. That'll explain it best. This is a one hour first look that I'm going to try to get on the YouTube ASAP. Uh, grab some, some food and uh, we're going to start our marathon run of eight hour hunt out right after this. Hey, look at that. Oh, we got to go and climb. We got to go up there and see if we can climb that. I forgot about that. Okay, let's put a dot. Boy, is this map ever dark. We're just getting rained out like crazy too. Getting rained out. Water. Oh, I'm in the water. Yeah. I'm gonna keep running too since we just made all this noise. We got seven minutes left on our scent spray. Aiden's got a little bit longer, so I'm not gonna probably reapply that. Later on, it'll be the game on. We'll be having really good hunt. I know it's gonna be good, and we're gonna be going hardcore after those alpine ibex. And again, Aiden is hosting this on his map. He does have a tent, and uh, you wanna you wanna grab this trophy? Oh. oh, I didn't get to see where I hit it, but anyway, it died, so uh, it was a female. 
I was wondering where I drilled it, but I could see the bullet wound was right, right in the behind the shoulder. You know, I'm not a deer, but it was right behind the front shoulder where you want it. So I think it was a lung shot. I I would you let you do it, but uh, oh, that's fine. Just to make sure you ask so before. I don't I don't care about the female, but some if it's a really big one, I want to make sure we get a good trophy shot. Okay, we're kind of doing the noob thing here to run, just uh, save a little little bit of time. Definitely not advisable if you're trying to really do a good hunt. Uh, we're going to stop running right up here. Let's start walking again, but we're not scaring everything off in the 10 mile radius. And uh, looks like there's almost a natural path going up there right here. We're going to explore all parts of this, hopefully, during our eight-hour hunt. We've also got Ross B. that, uh, of course, he's in Australia, and uh, right now it's like seven, 7 in the morning or something there, so he's probably just getting up. Haven't seen him pop in yet. Um, he'll be in tonight. I got him to go out the other night and take down all his stuff. And I hate when you get, like, a crumb on the mouse pad. Oh, my God, it drives me crazy. Um... We're going to go in and have him host a hunt at one point tonight so he can set up his stuff. Uh, Jay Weeda, we're going to do his, I think. Uh, I'm not sure what Evil's doing. I think he's waiting to see, kind of explore a little bit from the way it sounded before he sets, if he sets anything up in this map. And, so yeah, we got a, we got a lot to do. And at one point, don't quote me, but I'd like to open a public hunt uh, on here. Uh... I'm gonna try to m definitely make that happen during at one point or another for like an hour at least we have an open hunt and uh, just you know fill it up eight people eight people whoever can get in Ooh. and uh, this weekend there's also uh, anybody can hunt roe deer I don't know if this is gonna work I'm kind of nervous about falling a little bit. Looks like we got grass right up here. Kind of where there's grass you see you can walk, but then there's this. Come on up where I did. Definitely, definitely follow behind me, bud, so you, you get up here. Good job. What I did is almost... Like the rock climbing, guys. Yeah, it's just like a lot of rock climbing and these paths that lead out all over. So we're gonna discover this. I'm. I was just wondering if this is like a little tower you could actually go up in. That'd been neat. Um. Aiden, hey, hey, slow down, buddy. Come on. We got, we're, we are trying to hunt. Slow down. And, and just taking a deep breath. Plus, you don't want to run off the side of the cliff here. I think it'll let you actually do it too. And it looks like well, it looks like a door down there. I never w was paranoid about the falling. Well, Aiden, go ahead. Try to try to walk off of there. Try to walk off. Walk off there. <laughs> it let him do it. Okay. Oh. Yeah, Evil said he fell about five feet and, and he died. He he slid. He slid like, like a few feet like that and died. So, oh buddy, look at that. Whoops, look at this. Oh. This is exactly what I was talking about. You can't climb it. Oh, oh. my God, that is. But, but. Are you serious? Don't whistle. Back up for a minute. That kills me. That is... Come on. Expansive worlds. Are you serious? Are you ser You went through all this work and you don't give us the ability to get up in there. Oh my god. That is the biggest tease. I just... I want to cry. I think I want to cry. That would have been amazing if you could have gotten up in that thing. That could have been like a really neat free free stand for people to to have like 
How cool would that have been? Maybe they don't deem the ladder safe since it's an old relic. I don't know. Oh. I want to say bad things, but I won't. <laughs> Come on, give us give us a freebie. I just threw another hundred dollars into the game today. I wanted a freebie. Stop whistling. The, the good thing is, is um, there's no that was me that time. There's there's nothing that the whistle will scare in here. So. All right, no freebies, folks. Yeah, it's paid DLC. I'm pretty pretty sure that might be it. You gotta you gotta pay the DLC to get it. Well, we tried. No, it's not. That's a, that's a joke. There's no DLCs in this game. Just straight up buying EMs and buying your gear. I bought a pile of new tree stands, new tents. Um. Another bait barrel for bear. All that kind of stuff to put put a bunch of stuff up in here. And um, I think with Aiden here, well, before we get done, I think I'm going to definitely have him plop his tent wherever we end up. Now, let's see where we are right now. We're kind of right in the middle of the map. In fact, uh, yeah, I can tell there's a big ledge right there. Hmm. Yeah. Yep. Where do I put my... Well, where is it here? Did you get anything on yours? No, no, don't put your tent down right here, son. That put away. We're not putting your tent here yet. He is carrying his tent, so... I wanted to have him put it in a really good place, but I'm just going to have him plop it just to have it down. We can spawn on it and pick it up later. Better to put it down than to not, so... This this path here leads... I guess it just goes down to the river or something there. Here's another bowl. It might be good to plop a barrel down there. And then I'm not sure what... This almost looks like it might be another ledge. We might find Ibex down in this area. Hey, Dad, you were going to the wrong way. Well, I'm kind of thinking about... I was thinking about heading up here, but, you know, to be honest with you, um, they say you can find Ibex. I wonder if this is a area right here on the edge of the map that we might, you know, get lucky and spot one. Or should we go to see the other relic over here? What do you folks want us to do? Should we go see the other relic over here? Yeah, we did press E. Uh, it doesn't. It didn't give you even the option. You can't can't climb up into that puppy, unfortunately. Um, um, hey, Dad, I'm stuck for a minute. I kind of either we're either gonna fast travel to this lodge, and we're gonna have a hunt uh, up here where we might find an ibex. Or we're going to head straight over here, and we still might find an Ibex, because, you know, there's all these mountainy areas. So you guys uh, let me know. Plan plan A. Whoops. Plan A is to go to the uh, lodge. Plan B is to go to the old relic. i got to see where I put... Okay. We're going to walk. Hey, Bjorn... Glad that you like it. Go to the relic. Look at that. That just kills me. I just wanna... I want a cannon right now so I can shoot this thing to pieces. Oh, look at that little... little thing on top. That'd have been so neat. <laughs> Well, okay, we're gonna so we keep keep this in a timely fashion. Let's um, let's pick up our speed. I'm also gonna test this out. See what happens going down here. We're we're testing. Oh, yep, yeah, you definitely. Can. <laughs> Holy 
crap. Oh my god. <laughs> Was knocked out by a result of a slight disagreement with gravity. Uh, you are hurt. Press E to heal yourself. Use first aid kit. Alright, come on Aiden. Now, Aiden, go ahead and walk down. He's looking at me like, Daddy, I don't want to fall. No, just run. Just run. Just run. No. Just run down. Just run. Run. Run, run, run. I'm gonna make him run. Look at <laughs> look at how he fell. <laughs> oh no, he's hurt. Look at my boy. <laughs> That's it. Don't do anything. Don't do anything. Oh my god, Aiden, did you just seriously? Why do you hit buttons? I I don't think I can heal you. Oh my god, this kid and his buttons. Uh, I don't think I can heal him. Because you can't put these into the deal here. It's not something you can go and I think, uh, yeah, I used it once. I was going to heal you. You could have gotten up, but you're hitting buttons again. <sighs> Alright. Aiden's out of here. Didn't, didn't follow the directions. All I had to do, buddy, was go up to you and, and I could have healed you. So run run over to where I am. I don't know look, you have to look on your map. I think I'm going to probably end up fast traveling. He's a thousand meters. Um, yep, give me your deal here. Run there. Look at your PDA. Point your guy in that direction. We're still gonna go to the relic. He's not too much farther than what I am, and he'll run. We'll have him run. Maybe he'll drive us something. Now it makes me wonder what happened. We're gonna test this too. Oh, no, I didn't die there. <laughs> It was worth it. Chief Fallen. Speaking of Fallen, Chief Fallen 2014, thanks for following. <laughs> look look, look up with your mouse, buddy. You don't have to stare at the ground when you run. Just, yeah, keep her pointed in that direction. You know, follow your dot on your... See how your guy's pointed? We're back down to where we were a minute ago. It doesn't take much to die in here now, so they're going to be trying to sell a lot of med kits. I used uh, my GM, that's why it's important to do those missions, so I don't have to use real money uh, to, to uh, you know, to buy, uh, to buy all my stuff. If you die like that, you don't touch anything on your controls because I can walk up and pick you back up again. But because you you clicked out of it and went into your map to fast travel, you clicked the fast travel option. Uh, you lo I lost the ability to be able to go ahead and heal you, and uh, you would have gotten right back up like I did. But um, we're gonna fall in here. <laughs> it's just part of the. It's the, it's part of the part of the experience. And boy, did, is it rain a lot in here? Holy crap! I think um, you know, I'm wondering. I'm gonna keep running, folks, only because of time. Uh, I want to get close to the mountain because that's where you're gonna start seeing ibex. Uh, so, Aiden, you gotta run. You gotta keep running. You have to keep running, okay? Don't don't stop running. You can't walk. Oh 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 Jesus, look at this. Oh look at that. Oh there's is this is this is it no oh, oh oh that's a red no. All I saw was something bright. But what is it? 
I was a red deer. I almost shot at them, but um, kind of, kind of want to. I'm already doing one bad thing by running. Kind of, kind of coming up to these mountain thingies here, and I'm kind of wanting to run to uh, get up there, but uh, not, not shoot on top of it, because then we really will scare everything away. Uh, obviously, tonight on the big marathon, we'll be doing things the right way, uh, going very slow, and I'm sure killing a lot of critters along the way. Not sure of it. Uh, well, I'm, I'm sure of it. Inevitable. Wild the hot dog, what's going on? I do not want to run down a hill again. <laughs> He was so scared, I had to force him to run. Keep pointing uh, towards me, bud. You're not too far away. You're 500 meters, so I gotta make sure I'm going in the right direction. I can see what I think is the uh, thing up here, and I honestly don't know. I'd say we're in Ibex country. They like to get up in these mountains, and that's why we're running. We want to get up here and have a... Uh, a little bit of a hunt over here. You're not going to find those things down. They're basically a mountain goat. You're not going to find those things down in in the uh, lower valley, so. Oh, I do not want to run down hell again. Never again. Is that no. the worst time you've ever had in your life? It's, I do not want to run down a hill again. I know I'm just like looking at my screen. It's like, 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 I do. I want to do that again. Please don't. Okay, buddy. I'll never make you fall down a hill again. I'll never push you down a hill again. He's emotionally scarred now. My boy is not the same. Too bad rendering distance is um, not that far. It's about 200, you know, about 225. You can figure 225. It's if you see an animal, you'll see it till it hits 230. It'll take till about 218 before it pops back in again. So there's kind of like that little gray area. It's just kind of an average. Just figure right around 225. No, um, we can't even get up here. Uh, you're gonna have to really be crafty with your the ways you you gotta run, Aiden. Come on! I don't really don't want that. Why is your guy not running now? Okay, run. There you go. It'll take you eight years to get over here, and uh, I'm wondering. Oh, look at this, folks. This is a rock climbing spot. You can certainly tell just by looking at it. So we aren't going to be able to get up to the other place here. Um, we're going to find out if you can use your gear in somebody else's map. I am guessing that that is not going to be allowed. And you notice how the air, the sound uh, has changed? Uh, why, why is it getting out scent spray? Yeah, it's, I'm sure it would say like press E to place or something, but it's not my map, I'm not hosting, so uh, it's a no-go, but you can hear the difference in the in the wind. I have an animal over here. You see it? Please don't. Look, stop running. Stop running for a minute. And uh, look towards me. There is something over here. But Aiden would need to put the gear down in order for us to climb. Well, that's kind of a bummer. I want to see where we are on the map. See if there's a dark black line. No, there's nothing. 
No, well, there kind of is a small one, so... We're kind of at the edge of the map. Um, I'm going to continue to try to run or walk... ...over this way. Hey, do not slide down. Well, I'm pretty sure if I slid right here... Oh, I'll be dead. I, I don't think I'm done dying yet. Um... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Too fast. Too fast. Gonna die. Gonna die. <laughs> His face is priceless. His face is so priceless. <laughs> I do not want to see you die. Blood coming out of your mouth. Let's see. Blood coming out of <laughs> This kid. This kid is traumatized. I think, uh, oh my goodness, I think Aiden is, uh, well, they're gonna have to mark this game up. They're gonna have to mark it up a, a level here. Gonna have to go from, uh, everyone to a teen. Not for, not recommended for four-year-olds. <laughs> Watching their fathers <laughs> going down a mountain. <laughs> Well, they have climbing ropes. We're just experimenting. This, this, folks, is not the correct way to, to hunt. So, well, we're not so... I'm actually not so concerned about the hunting part right at this moment. Uh, it's more... It's more about what can I get up to? How can I get up there? And, uh... What is... What are we limited to? It seems like wherever you see grass is climbable. Like, if it has grass on it... <laughs> but, I don't know. And I think, you know, for those people that don't have money for the uh, the ropes or they don't have the missions done, the GMs, I think you'd still be able to get an Alpine uh, Ibex in an area like this. Oh, God. Uh, on the side of, like, the mountain or something. I know that you definitely can, because Evil hadn't used any ropes. He spawned in at this lodge, uh, he was telling me, and I popped into his game for a minute to look at his map of where he went, and he walked all the way up and around like this, and they were killing a bunch of them. And I believe, I believe Jason killed one somewheres. He walked over here, and I think he killed one somewheres up around here that he was able to get to. So I still haven't seen uh, killed one. I've seen I've seen them on uh, another live stream, but uh, they're just like a gray-looking uh, goat thingy with horns on its head. It's nothing too spectacular, but I uh, definitely still want to bust one. <laughs> I w was hoping Aiden and I would see one, but we're really you know not in the right area, and uh, we're definitely. Yeah, but, uh, gotcha. yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna put a tent. Uh, up on top of mine. This is something you're gonna definitely want to have some tents. Yeah, you can't. There's there's nowhere that they're gonna let you up. I mean, you're. Oh, and there's a fox. I probably missed the call already. Yep, did. Son of a mother. That stinks. Okay, there we go. He's uh, right up here. Boy, he's going to be close to me again. Aiden, where are you at? Um, right here. Are you right behind me? Oh, you're right there. Oh, sweet. All right, let's kill this. Let's get this fox. Well, I'm you got your shot. Get your shotgun out. my bow to shoot it because I want to try a, a fox with my bow, okay guys? Okay, I would recommend your shotgun, but uh, if you want to use your bow, you got arrows in it, right? Okay. Stop, 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 stop. stop. Come over here quick. You gotta go quick. 
Like, come over here, quick. Come on, move, 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 move. Go, go, go. Aiden, we don't have a lot of time. This fox is coming. I blew the call. Get up on this rock. Walk, walk up there, quick, quick, quick. You gotta go very fast with... No, 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 don't run, don't run. Why? Oh my god. Alright, I think we blew our opportunity here for this, uh... Now crouch. That's the bad thing about using bow, is you're much more visible. Um, if you were go to go... I don't think we're gonna see this fox get close enough for your bow. Neither one of us are using scent spray either. He's right there. Get your shotgun out. Uh, you're gonna do the. Sh I'm gonna have. I'm gonna have you do shotgun. Come on. Uh, um, it's in my inventory. We're not we're not set up for him to do bow right now. We both need to be using scent spray and I think this thing already ran and I just you know that or it's sitting right there. I think it already ran away. Nope, it's right there. Ooh, it's a nice black one, Aiden. Get your shotgun. Get your shotgun. Just wait, just wait for him. Because you don't have your scope on. Right there. He's right over there. See him? Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot! Nice job, buddy. Oof. Yeah, that's what I mean. You gotta go so fast with these these fox ones. You call them. You can't sit around and and that's what happened earlier. So, um, we would have both needed to put scent spray on. And since I'm about to end the hunt, I don't want to waste scent spray uh, on that. But um, I'm glad that I did not have him use bow. Uh, felt bad, but this thing was hard enough to see. It's a dark one. I haven't even killed one like that. Oh, don't, don't, don't tag him. I want to get a screenshot of that for you. Hey, come up, come up behind me. Oh, got him in the brain. A nice headshot. Yep. Yep. Uh, trophy shot on that one. Oh, harvest the red fox. Oh, that's part of a big uh, mission that I got going on right now. But uh, it's come up like ten times already. I need to do like five other things to complete it. But all right, uh, I'm gonna put my gear away and oh, my glasses look funny. Get right up here. This will be this will be our thumbnail. We'll make a thumbnail out of it. That is a nice. That is a nice one, Aiden. That just doesn't look natural. Well, well I want his teeth open and his mouth open. Do you want his mouth open? Yeah. One thing I gotta do is like get this camera zoomed out. Kinda, kinda hoping they refine this trophy shot thing just a little bit more. I think they've done some work to it over time, but really a bugger to. I just want them to separate like the animal from the hunter. That's an that's a nice one right there. What do you think about that, bud? You like you like that picture? Yeah. We'll, we'll we'll do that. It's not the best, but that's a nice fox, Aiden. That is a nice fox. Nice black feet on it. That was a red fox. That uh, very very much almost a darker black one. So it's a little bit more rare fox. And I'm not sure if I've ever killed one like that so I think that was his first fox too uh, could be mistaken but we'll definitely get you you know we'll, we'll get you to kill some with the bow in here but we gotta be ready for it and I I had already blown the call and I don't think we would have he would have spotted us 
Uh, it's better if you're going to shoot fox with a bow that you're in a tree stand. Or, you know, using face paint and, and really ready to go. Like, you got to be good with that bow because you're crouching. They're going to see you. And they're going to spook. So, that's the nice thing about using a, a gun or a crossbow. Crossbow would be good too because you could go prone. Get them right close to you and pop them. Hey, Felden, how's it going? All right. Um. Oh, now it's time to hunt some goalies. I know. I wish we could have seen some, but uh, we're getting, we're getting, we're pushing our streams off here, and I'm gonna have, to, I gotta have time to get the uh, the other one ready and get this on the YouTube. So, folks, we're gonna end this one right here. We're gonna have a break for about uh, 45 minutes to an hour. I might be a little later than the 6 o'clock time, and then we'll be back for our big marathon hunt. So, uh, I'd say don't go anywhere, but uh, you probably don't want to wait around, and I completely understand. So, <laughs> we'll be ending this stream here, and Aiden, why don't you put your get your tent out? It's going to be a real bugger to put that thing down here, but... Uh, it's like zero, I think. There you go. Try to see if you can put it down anywhere. Oh. Like walk until it turns white. You gotta find a flat spot. And we might unfortunately have to run down here. Hey, what's this? I think that's a road deer we just saw skipping away. White. Yeah, run, run down here. Hurry up. Come, run. You gotta stand up. Run. Run, 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 run. Should have got your screen name Slow and Pokey. Slow Pokey. <clears throat> Except when he sees something neat, boy, he'll take off 100 mile an hour running, even when there's an animal around. Daddy, look! I'm expecting these same results when we get to doing RL hunting here soon. Taking them out in the woods and. Right down here you should be able to plop it, and at least it's in the middle of the map. Definitely be able to put it here. Keep her running, bud. Keep her running. Killer Lars, NL, thank you so much Bye. for the follow. Keep running. Keep going, buddy. Right there. That's fine. Boom. Alright, that's not where we're going to keep it. Uh, we'll probably buy Aiden some gear or something. We're gonna we're gonna find a good place to put it, but for right now, he'll have a spawn point here, here, and here. So better than not having it out at all. But I'm thinking we're probably gonna go explore this. But I'll probably maybe do that during the live stream. Uh, maybe Saturday, Sunday, something like that. We'll set his up, and uh, Aiden's also gonna get a setup for hogs so that I can have public hunts. Since he's on a different internet connection, that way we can have people come in during live streams and do those big, those big uh, hunts where I invite people in and we do a big hog slaughter. And uh, we're going to try to do something like that here with the bear, using the terrain as to our advantage. Maybe getting up high on a peak or something, not up on the peak, but up on a hill and like shooting some bear that are down low and and that kind of thing. So I don't know how good that'll work on this map, but. Um, that's the that's the plan. He's got uh, tree stands, a bait barrel, and a tower stand. Those new tower stands that came out, Aiden has one too. We're gonna get them all set up out here. So uh, for now, Aiden, look at the camera. Which camera? <laughs> oh, he's in his inventory. He's busy at work. You gonna stare? Look at me. <laughs> he doesn't know which one in the game. I'm over here. Hey, buddy! Alright, guys. Don't, uh, don't go anywhere too far. We're gonna, we're gonna end this one. You can just leave it right there. We're gonna end this live stream right here so I can get this uploaded on YouTube. I don't even know if it's gonna have enough time, but, um, we'll be back here. It might be more towards 6.30 now. Might, because we pushed this one about a half hour, almost a half hour over. So, we'll be back between 6, 6.30, about an hour from now. 
and uh, we'll have a good marathon running for about eight hours with all kinds of different hunts. I'll be starting out hosting the first one. will be me and Evil, and I'm going to go start putting all my gear, my tower stand, tents, uh, all that stuff. We're going to have a big hunt, so look forward to seeing everybody back here real soon. Uh, 